Welcome back all my certified lover boys and girls to the Neville Goddard son of Abdullah channel. Still swiping right faster than you can say, Netflix and chill. Alone. Feeling more, ghost town, than, happily ever after, in your love life? Well, ditch the dating app disasters and the endless, wide, texts. We're about to drop some next level manifestation secrets that'll have you attracting your dream partner faster than you can say, soulmate. But here's the tea. The algorithm is a shady character. Apparently, only 9% of you beautiful subscribers are getting notified when we unleash these game-changing love potions. So smash that subscribe button like you're hitting that buy now button after 3 a.m. online shopping. Hit that notification bell too, because together, we're gonna manifest a world where 11 million people are living their dream love stories by the end of 2024. Let's make this video go viral faster than a celebrity breakup on Twitter. Alright, enough chit-chat. You're here for the good stuff. Manifesting your ideal partner using the law of assumption. Forget the endless swipes and awkward first dates. We're talking about attracting your soulmate like a beehive attracts concert tickets, or that barista at your coffee shop with the dreamy smile, whichever works for you. But here's the twist. It all starts with you. Hold up, though. You might be thinking, isn't love all about finding the right person? Nope. That's like trying to find your happily ever after while wearing rose-colored glasses that distort reality. You gotta become the catch of the day first, baby. We're talking self-concept makeover, Neville Goddard style. Neville Goddard, the OG of manifestation, used to say your mind is like a choose-your-own-adventure novel. You're the author, the director, the whole darn cast. But guess who's been sneaking in those cheesy rom-com plot twists? Your subconscious, whispering negativity like a troll in the comments section. I'm not lovable. I'll never find someone who truly gets me. Sound familiar? That's where self-concept swoops in like a knight in shining armor, or a charming barista with a perfect latte art swan. It's your core belief about who you are, not just as a single person, but as a partner. Think of it as your dating profile bio, but way more important than how many likes you have. Rewrite your bio and become the irresistible catch you truly are. Alright, here comes the slightly spicy part, because we like to keep things interesting. Some folks say manifestation is all about putting yourself out there and endless dating disasters. We say, what if you attracted your soulmate without the awkward small talk and bad first dates? Enter Abdullah, the Ethiopian mystic shrouded in more mystery than a season finale of Stranger Things. He had some hardcore techniques for self-concept overhaul when it comes to love. We're talking about methods so effective, they'll have you feeling like you've downloaded a perfect relationship operating system for your mind. But hold up! Are we talking some wacky sci-fi, jumping dimensions, stuff here? Not quite. Think of it as a mental shortcut. By changing your self-concept, you're essentially making a quantum leap to a reality where you're already in a fulfilling relationship. Pretty cool, right? Imagine those butterflies in your stomach when you see your partner, the feeling of being completely understood and supported. Spend time visualizing these moments, feeling the emotions as vividly as possible. The universe loves clarity, so the more specific you are, the better. Remember Abdullah's, living the end, technique? Apply it here. Dress up for a date night, even if it's just you and Netflix. Treat yourself to a couple's massage, solo version, obvi, radiate confidence, and let the universe know you're ready for love. But here's the secret sauce, you gotta love yourself first. You can't attract a healthy relationship if your self-concept is a dusty old self-help book filled with negativity. Shower yourself with love, affirmations, and bubble baths, because self-care is sexy. People. Now, let's be real. Doubt is a party crasher at the manifestation mansion. That sneaky voice whispering, you're not good enough. Don't listen to that gremlin. Neville recommended affirmations to combat doubt. Write down positive statements about yourself and your worthiness of love. Repeat them like a mantra. Fake it till you make it, manifestation edition. All right. Manifestation fam, share your biggest love-related limiting belief in the comments below. Is it, I'm not lovable, I'll always be alone. Let's smash those beliefs together and rewrite your love story. As Neville Goddard himself said, the world is a mirror and you are looking at yourself. So make sure the reflection you see is radiating love, confidence, and the knowledge that you deserve a phenomenal partner. Now go forth and manifest your dream relationship. Just be warned. This might involve fewer awkward first dates and more spontaneous romantic getaways. You're welcome. If you found value in this video, remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss another one of our magical manifestation movies.
Peace and blessings fam. Volume underscore up. Segments 1220, continued. Segment 12, Law of Assumption Practical Steps. Host. Imagine those butterflies in your stomach when you see your partner, the feeling of being completely understood and supported. Spend time visualizing these moments, feeling the emotions as vividly as possible. The universe loves clarity, so the more specific you are, the better. Segment 13. Humor Manifestation Mistakes. Host. Disclaimer. Visualizing yourself handcuffed to your soulmate in a candlelit bubble bath might be a tad intense, and probably illegal. Keep it light, keep it positive, and focus on the emotions of a loving relationship. Segment 14. Living the End. Host. Remember Abdullah's, living the end, technique? Apply it here. Dress up for a date night, even if it's just you and Netflix. Treat yourself to a couple's massage, solo version, obvi, radiate confidence, and let the universe know you're ready for love. Segment 15. Self-love is key. Host. But here's the secret sauce. You gotta love yourself first. You can't attract a healthy relationship if your self-concept is a dusty old self-help book filled with negativity. Shower yourself with love, affirmations, and bubble baths, because self-care is sexy. People. Segment 16. Dealing with doubt. Host. Now, let's be real. Doubt is a party crasher at the Manifestation Mansion. That sneaky voice whispering, you're not good enough. Don't listen to that gremlin. Neville recommended affirmations to combat doubt. Write down positive statements about yourself and your worthiness of love. Repeat them like a mantra. Fake it till you make it, Manifestation Edition. Segment 17. Call to Action 2. Host. Alright, Manifestation fam, share your biggest love-related limiting belief in the comments below. Is it, I'm not lovable, I'll always be alone. Let's smash those beliefs together and rewrite your love story. Segment 18. Success Story. Host. Speaking of rewriting love stories, here's a quick shout-out to Jessica from the comments. She used these techniques and manifested the man of her dreams, a cute veterinarian with a rescue puppy addiction, because who can resist that? See, it works. Segment 19. Neville Goddard Quote. Host. As Neville Goddard himself said, the world is a mirror and you are looking at yourself. So make sure the reflection you see is radiating love, confidence, and the knowledge that you deserve a phenomenal partner. Segment 20. Humor Closing. Host. Now go forth and manifest your dream relationship. Just be warned, this might involve fewer awkward first dates and more spontaneous romantic getaways. You're welcome, 